comparing yourself is that comparison thing is really, really, um, it's a problem still. I mean, it's getting worse, you know, because I mean, we, we compare ourselves to people that appear healthy. No. And I don't mean like physically fit. Because I mean, of course, we see things externally. We see, okay, they, they typically, okay, they look like a nice shape. They must be healthy. Mm-hmm. We don't know what their insides look like. Right. We have no idea what they're consuming. We have no idea who they're, um, what they believe in. We have no idea, yeah. you know. And um, we're comparing ourselves to these people that appear healthy and forgetting that we are all different individuals with all different types of assignments. Mm-hmm. We all have different assignments, you know, and it's just like I was explaining to some girls on, on a past episode, you know, we like to, um, we like to, um, I would say, create this, we, we like to cre- create our desires based on somebody else's desires, we like to create our story based on, uh, yes, their desires. So, for instance, somebody may like this, and because it looks nice and because it appears to be great, oh, she got that from a significant other. Okay, well, um, this person may, this other woman might say, well, I'm single. You know, that's the reason why I want to be with somebody, mm-hmm. because this girl is enjoying this. Nine times no. out of ten, you have no idea what that girl's situation is like. At all. That might not be for you. That may not <laughs> be for you. And yeah. that might not be for her. Uh, her either. <laughs> exactly. Her either. Yeah. It may not be for her. Yeah. But we sit down and we compare ourselves on what other people have. And we make that our goal. It's unfor- the unfortunate side of social media. Ugh, you know what I mean? Two, internet, side, two sides to everything. You know, mm-hmm. it's a good side and a bad side. I mean, this is a obviously a good side of social media and utilizing the platform. But, of course. you know, that other side, as they say, you're looking at someone's highlight reels. You mm-hmm. know, you you didn't see them. You don't realize that they actually crying as they taking a picture wow. of whatever yeah. object it is that you desire. You know what I mean? So, like, nah... If you really knew, you wouldn't want it. But it's just like, if you stop comparing and be content, Mm -hmm. not necessarily complacent, but be content with where you at, knowing that you're going forward. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just, it really comes down to the basis of, as you mentioned, self. Yes. You know, if I'm doing what's best for, for self in the standpoint of development, then others are going to they're going to they're going to reap the fruit of that. Wow. You know, if it's like okay, like yeah. Nope, my pay grade has went down to here or whatnot, but this mission that I'm on is going to provide so value up to here. Right. Then focus on that. Fo- right. Just just focus focus on that and taking those steps and everything will take care of itself as opposed to Oh, uh, what they gonna think about me now that I, now that I didn't took this entrepreneurial route? Well, when you've always had an audience, and when you've always had an audience, how do you now take yourself away from that audience? You are. It's easy to say, "Oh man, what are these people gonna think?" You, you're always. You're the one that you share a lot. You share a lot. And you've always had an audience, not only just an audience that's just looking, but people that literally are expecting you because you created that expectation for them, Mm -hmm. you know? And so I think the problem is that people on the internet, sometimes we just don't have discernment to know what's for the internet and what's not. And so we have these these ideas that people are looking at us, man, we we gotta make sure we get this finished out. We gotta make sure we do it like this. Forgetting that, you know, people don't care. At all. <laughs> they don't care. <laughs> At all. They really they don't. don't. So whether you start over or not, they don't care. Yeah. That's that they ego. They genuinely don't. That's that ego aspect, thinking that they do. Mm-hmm. But they don't. Mm-hmm. People don't. At all. But I mean, just imagine having creating this narrative that they do. And mm-hmm. so you're doing all that it takes to complete this task. And you're not, and you're not stewarding it properly because you're doing it for somebody else. Yeah. Because you're doing it for the likes of others and because people desire to see you be great. Why don't you don't desire yourself to be great by yourself? If you live for them, what did I have a coach tell me 
a long time ago. He said, if you live for the applause, you will die by the booze. <laughs>